tonight at 9 on 13. Thanks to our members and the following for their support of 13's programming today. at West 54th. The highly acclaimed music performance series returns for a new season, hosted by John Hyatt. This week, Diana Krall, the hottest jazz singer to emerge in years. Then, Los Lobos show why they're not just another band from East L.A. That's Diana Krall and Los Lobos, this week on Sessions at West 54th. Friday night at midnight, simulcast on 90.7 FM WFUV. Every year, millions of women are abused. So chances are, someone you care about may be getting hurt. If you know about it, don't ignore it. People like you are speaking out to end relationship abuse. And for that, millions of women are thankful. Help stop domestic violence. With Momix, it's, it's a mix of many different things. It's theater, performance art, it's body sculpture. It's a lot of concern that I have to make these paintings come to life through uh, light and sound. So many people, when they see the company, ask, well, what is it? Is it dance? Is it theater? Is it circus? And it's very much all of those things. any rules for anything as long as it's musical and it's it, I, I'm, I'm all for an audience not uh, falling asleep during our show Moses is like a, a cyclone of of ideas and concepts and plays on, plays on words and the key word there is cyclone <laughs> cyclone he he mix he comes in they and everything's mix. like <laughs> you know We made an improvisation on skis, and that was the uh, origins of the piece. The tape recorder was screwed up, and that's why it's playing slow speed and gives it that now, the very viscous kind of underwater quality. And so all of that kind of made it for an interesting piece. I never know what I'm doing either. I mean, I just have a notion that, you know, if we're going to start doing something, let's play and let's record it, and let's think of what the, the next day could offer us, and you know, direct this kind of collaboration is more what I do. Momming sometimes is like a circus. I always find my, <laughs> myself as an artist being thrown into a situation that at first is not completely comfortable. His work is very influenced by nature, and I think that's a very, very important element that makes this company unique. One of the primary elements that distinguishes Momix from other companies is the use of props. I think there's a wonderful uh, example is, is Sputnik. These, uh, these poles as extensions to the arm, to the legs, so that you can have someone lift someone 10 feet away using a fulcrum. You know, our body's made up of fulcrums and levers. It's just extending it into space and creating that kind of magic through the use of the prop. There's something fascinating about motion that uh, really does get us. And if we can get other things like barrels or balloons or sculptures or bodies in space moving, there's something about a gravity that excites us. There's many special effects and props that we use. Basically, it's a physical theater. The body is the most special effect. It's, the, it's what we use, what we train. Moses once said that if you can make the audience witness a human being doing something they didn't think possible, then that in itself is a viable artistic goal.
And once you got to a certain level of shape, you could actually begin to uh, enjoy playing with various physical activity that wouldn't it exhaust you. The problem with most people is they're too out of shape. They're too tired. They're missing out on their life. They're missing out on the life of the body, which is, is life for me. We're not really in America as much as we're in New England. It's sort of like a, a, a large park. I'm held to the area by this lake. It's a place where no matter how your day goes, how bad it goes, you can go and discharge all that negativity into the, uh, into the crystalline spirit of Lago de Tom, Mount Tom Pond. The piece that we're working on is called EC, short for extracelestial, or the brother of ET, the extraterrestrial. Five people coordinated, working together. One person is the hands, one person is the legs, another person is the head, another person is the body. So you have four different people working those body parts all in unison, trying to musicalize them and give them dance dynamics. It's very hard. The idea for Medusa came from an umbrella. <laughs> I just happened to see this umbrella and I thought, what would it be like to put this diaphanous fabric over this umbrella? And it, it was really beautiful, the image of the woman inside. It's, it's mostly about metamorphosis. It has been said that MoMA exists to dance with Cirque du Soleil is to circus that you've just, we've just pushed it in another direction. If they can walk out of our shows with a little less gravity in their step through the, whatever they've seen that's been uh, mysterious, magical, inspiring, and then it's been uh, effective. It's actually moved people, and uh, that's very satisfying. There's a method to all this madness, you know, and it has results. I lost my artistic license about right. six years ago, and if the art police get a hold of this tape, yeah, they're going to take me in. They're going to take me in, definitely. With great thanks, 13 acknowledges endowment support from Vera Eberstadt. Our endowment donors provide ongoing funding for 13's programming and educational endeavors. The generosity of Vera Eberstadt will be appreciated for generations to come. Last month, New York, a documentary film by Rick Burns wowed everyone. The critics rave. Nothing short of gripping surpasses the highest expectations. The kind of compelling television found only on public television. One more proof that nobody does the big projects better. Stunning, epic, and classy. Wondrous. Now 13 gives you another chance to experience this landmark series. New York, the encore. All 10 hours in just one day. Saturday, December 18th, starting at 2, right here. Technology in the classroom, opening a world of possibilities. The internet is an incredible tool. All those technologies helps to capture their imagination, their attention. It brings the whole world into your classroom. 13's National Teacher Training Institute is helping teachers reach students with 21st century technology. Cisco Systems, empowering the internet generation. 13's partner in education. American Ballet Theater spins a tale of pirates and harem slaves and star-crossed love at first sight. Classic melodrama, but who cares about the plot when it's the dancing that takes your breath away? Great dancing, great fun, great performances. Don't miss American Ballet Theater in Le Corsair. Monday night at 9 on 13. This holiday season, enjoy our lowest international rates ever to Japan, Taiwan, and Hong Kong for just 15 cents a minute. Season's greetings from Courtney Love, next all new Rosie O'Donnell Show. 